Yeah. So we've SSH into our CAN bus adapter through the phone. Um, I can't show you that right now because I had to do it on the phone that I'm actually taking the video with. But I've got a screenshot I'll add to the video so you'll be able to see it. Okay, so now we're going to set up the client side. So we're going to do sudo list remote. 100, 97, 101, 10. Oh, I know, I have to set jail scale first. Okay, so now we're gonna set tail scale. So we're gonna go sudo system ctl start tail scale. Thing. Okay, now we're going to do sudo USB IP list dash remote and our IP address for our Raspberry Pi zero. Okay, and there we find, we see, we have Open Mo Moco Geschweister Schneider Can Adapter. So there it is. So next, we're going to do sudo USB IP attach remote, our IP address. Okay, now if we do IP link, we can see we have CAN zero, but the state is down. So we're gonna set it up. So we're gonna do sudo IP link, oops, it's that, link, set CAN zero type, can and bit rate 500,000. And then we're going to do sudo IP link set can zero up. We can see now our device is uh, active. And all three LEDs are blinking. So we can check that. And we'll do can sniffer and can zero. Ah, and look at that. So we have a bunch of data coming out here all sorts of stuff so that's kind of neat huh all right now what we're going to do is we're going to open wireshark enter our password Now you can see we have CAN0 listed. So we're going to choose that. And look, all our data packets, our CAN bus data packets, captured in Wireshark. <laughs>